Nice. They're trying to get away, but guess what? The chances of that happening are severely hurt by the fact that you can't steer your ship right now. And they're definitely hurt now by the fact that you're dead. 61 scrap. No store. Um, this other nebula doesn't matter, except for the fact that I pretty much have to go to... I don't, though. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Uh, sadly, this doesn't go there. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Something like that. So actually, we are going to the nebula simply because we can't get... We can't get all of the, like, this will be not enough jumps. One, two, three, four, five. We can hit six if we go to the nebula, too. One, two, three, four, five, six. So we're going to do that. Yes. I should probably go to the medbay. Investigate the battlefield. Ah, uh, it is what love is. They at least can't teleport over. Good. Shoot their shields, and look at that. They missed. <sighs> Luckily, we have the same crazy dodge percentage they do, apparently. But I would prefer winning this fight by hitting their ship occasionally instead of not hitting it ever. That'll definitely help. <laughs> Not gonna lie, that will help. Okay, heavy laser right back at the frickin' weapons. Accept their offer, no. I don't want to accept your offer, I want you to die. And I should have shot at their weapons. Because they're gonna get another missile off and there's nothing I can do about it. And they missed. Thank you, easy mode. Not that easy mode actually affects that at all. Uh, 78 scrap. I am seriously considering buying one power and running like this. We are so far ahead of the curve. Except for the fact that even though we're playing on easy mode, we're at 16 hole points. Pay their toll. <laughs> yeah, not going to happen. Um, I think instead of the dodge, I'm going to want that system repair drone. Although it looks like it might be an ion weapon. Uh, accept their offer. No. You should have thought of that before you tried to hurt us. And then this will kill him. I guess we don't need the system repair drone. Okay. Useful material. That's good. Okay, we're going to duck into this nebula, even though it's not going to help us as far as picking a place to go here. Follow and help them. Alice! Welcome to the crew, Alice. You left your restaurant, and you are uh, going to get renamed. Your name isn't actually Alice. That was your that was your name. It was actually Francois. Francois, the fighting mantis. We are now a team, you and I. Uh, you have no skills, so you're actually going to go, you're going to go to into the dodge for now, but I'm not sure if that's actually going to stay. Um, that's going to make defending the ship a lot better, which makes the anti-personnel drone a lot less useful. But we'll see what that actually means as far as, uh, uh, we're going to attack the slavers, and we are probably going to take whatever you offer us. Um, but first we're going to heavy eye on here. Your weapons don't scare us because we got two shields, so we're going to go right for your cockpit. I just realized we don't even have a scanner on this ship. Like, we couldn't upgrade the scanner. We can't get the, the Mantis into the scanner room <laughs> to hopefully <laughs> see what's on their ship because we don't even have a scanner. I mean, what did they say when they were designing this ship? Shepard. Shepard. Um... That's the worst. Why couldn't you at least have some skill? We're going to accept you, though, because we need people on this ship. And Shepard, you are not Shepard. 
You are Nathan. Nathan the human. We're getting an eclectic crew here. Nathan is going on engines, and Francois is going on weapons. We should probably set you guys' locations here. Um, I want Francois to be able to leave his post on a whim, and it's easier to do that on weapons than it is on engines. Aid the civilian ship. Hey, another ship that can't hurt us. Note the distinct lack of teleporters on the enemy ships now that we uh, have a Mantis on board. Okay, we'll make short work of them. Sorry if this is boring, but uh, there's not much to do. This is this is pretty standard fare here. Take out their ability to dodge, shoot their weapons when you have to, keep their shields down with the heavy ion, and go to town. There's not much else to watch. The resisting is annoying, but what are you going to do? There we go. Put a hole in their in their cockpit there, so this shot will kill them. Contact the civilians. Nigel wants on board. Holy cow! I wish I hadn't taken the. Uh, <laughs> I wish I hadn't taken the human, although we're glad to have you, Nathan. Um, Nigel, though, is Dr. Nobody. Nobody likes Dr. Nobody. Okay, you are going to Shields. Um, and actually, honestly, I think you're going to Doors. And then you'll run to Shields if they're not boarding. Um, and we better go to the exit, although this is... This is easy mode, but it still doesn't matter because it's, it's, we're only going to get one extra jump for not going to the exit, and then we're going to use that up by not getting the exit jump. Civilians are uncharted. Well, let's go to civilian because we want stores. We want lots and lots of stores. And, of course, we don't see any of those stores that we want. Um, so I think we're going to upgrade the engines and not buy the power for it. Yeah, we basically don't need any of these drones now. We can start thinking about... Um, uh, drones that'll help us uh, offensively. He's trying to get away. He can't hurt us. Um, so yeah, we're, it's the standard deal. The uh, We're going to go take his shield down, ideally. And then alternate between the two. I guess you can get shield experience here. <clears throat> nice. I like it when it puts holes in the hull, that's for sure. Yeah, slug wouldn't be uh wouldn't be untoward on this ship. I would not mind at all. If a slug were to hop on board. We've got 93 scraps, still no store, so we're gonna buy the power for that dodge that we wanted. Next up is shields. <laughs> Intervene to defend the outpost, huh? Yeah, let's do it. All you have is a missile and, of course, a shield. So we're going to have to go first and foremost for your... Nice. Weapons are down and down forever. Which means he's basically dead. If either of these breaches the hull, then then he's never going to dodge again. He's probably never going to dodge again anyway. And he's never going to dodge again. <laughs> 18 scrap, 22 for the outpost. We've got 108, still no store. Um, I'm getting really worried about, about weapons. Um, if we get out of this, out of this, uh, sector without a, another weapon, we are basically dead in the water. Attack the automated ship to get to the storage cache. Well, yeah, the automated ship might have something we want. And they've hit our weapons. Which means, assuming the heavy ion has time to charge up, which it should, uh, you should be on shields. Okay, now they can't hurt us, which is important. 
We're probably not going to get that second shot off before they... Yeah, I didn't think so. So we need to wait on the heavy laser now until the heavy ion shoots their shields. But then the next shot is going to go for the drone because I don't want to deal with... That hacking. I would have preferred it if that had caused a hole breach. <laughs> but you can't have everything. That caused a hole breach, which means he's never going to get away. And this heavy laser is going to kill him. Nice. Investigate the station. Anti-ship fire drone. We are just going to get that thing going. Uh... We're going to take the system repair drone out. going to put this fire drone in. Cost three, but we have three. There's a distress call here. No freaking store. We've seen that there's no store here. We have not seen here. So I think we're actually going to go down here because I want to I want to see the whole sector because we have to get to a store. Uh, there isn't one down there, so I guess we might as well go to this distress call. Yeah, let's go out of here. I think in easy mode, you can actually get through Sector 3 without seeing any level 2 shields, but it's not very likely, I don't think. He cannot hurt us. Which doesn't bother me one bit. The important thing to remember is we can hurt him. <laughs> so, there's that. I love hearing that hull breach when you when you hit their ship, because now we're gonna now we're gonna hit their cockpit. They're trying to escape. I suspect that might not happen. Okay, drones are down. Next shot will quite literally kill them, and it should sneak in under the shields if I know my timings. Yes. Okay, useful scrap material, 174. We should just upgrade that shield, because we're going to sell so much when we uh, when we get to that store. So let's go ahead and upgrade our shields, and not buy the power for them. Instead, we're going to run like this, even though it's massive overkill. <laughs> uh, Anti-personnel drone, well, hey, might as well do it. 16 scrap, and a store, awesome. Yeah, we're selling all the drones, except for the, maybe the fire drone. Um, okay, two heavy ions is much better. I think we got to buy this charge ion and two weapon power. Okay, so we're going to sell... I think we're going to sell all three drones. Let's let's do this and see what we can do here. Charge ion or or the other heavy ion. The night oh it's thirteen seconds. The nice thing about the two heavies is it's four ion damage. If they both hit, that's two shields down instantly. Um, the charge ion. The nice thing about it is it will it will keep their stuff down and it won't like if if. If this hits and this one first one misses and then the next one hits, we're still going to be char we're still going to be ironing their stuff. So I think it's worth the extra 5 bucks for the charge ion. Then we are going to uh, go to upgrades and we're going to just buy two and one power. And we're going to run like this and like this for now. We don't really need that shield. That shield is overkill. Um and honestly, the fire drone is overkill, too. I don't really see us using that fire drone because we don't have scanners. Uh, so let's go ahead and sell it. Just for the money. Um, we've got 16 hull. We don't need fuel. We don't need any of this stuff. Um, I would like better weapons. Uh, the backup battery would have been useful before, but it's not useful anymore. There's another store here. Um, I don't think we're going to go to it. I think we're going to go one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, this other store is pretty much useless unless we find something awesome here, which doesn't look like it's going to happen. Okay, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to get our shields all the way up. Then we are going to ion both of those things. Hope he doesn't get our weapons. Okay, that's not a big deal, actually. Of all the things he could hit. This also lets our, uh, our heavy laser fire faster, which is nice. 
Okay, now we can up our dodge, not that it matters. Uh, we will not accept that surrender. That surrender is crap. <clears throat> yeah, this is definitely a loadout that we can't really maintain. Um, one weapon to do damage is really not what I'm looking at here. Um, if I could find a uh, drone recovery arm, I would go for offensive drones out the wazoo. Um, i got to wait for our shields. We are going to jump. <laughs> Rather than let that thing hit our shields. Uh, okay, they're going to attack us. They've only got one attack strength. So we are going to eye on at those. And I think we're going to heavy laser their weapons just so that, so that uh, bomb can't get us. <clears throat> and that's basically it. They're dead. End of story. I don't think they're going to ever get a shot off. Actually, they'll probably get a shot off. No, you didn't even get a shield bonus for that. Five missiles. Yeah, we're not going to accept that. Try offering something we want next time. Twenty-four scraps, seventy-four total. Another store. Well, we're going to it, so let's see. I mean, we might pick up a flak, and then we'll drop uh, the heavy ion probably for it. Uh... <laughs> God, everyone has a heavy ion. Um, pike beam instead of the heavy ion. Ugh. I like the the chance of extra damage. I don't like. How it's hard it's going to be to get through shields. But I think we got to take what we can get here. Bye bye, Heavy Ion. Hello, Pike Beam. Uh, we don't need fuel. We don't need fixing. We do need basically everything else possible. Um, hacking would be nice, but we'll deal with it the way it is. Okay, we're going to put the Pike Beam first. This is a weird loadout. Um, let's go ahead and do this. And we got two jumps before the exit. We know they're not a store, so I think I'm going to buy one power just to get my dodge all the way up, and then we can siphon that into shields if we really need to for some reason. Attack the pirate. Uh, yeah, we'll attack the pirate, especially because he can't hurt us. And we're going to just ion, heavy laser, and pike beam. <sighs> oh, darn. I'm not even gonna I don't care that we're that we're not doing this very accurately. <laughs> I'm like honey badger. I don't care. <laughs> I don't even know why I'm shooting at their weapons. I should be shooting at their cockpit. Uh yeah, they want to escape, you go right ahead. Uh piracy cannot be forgiven. We're gonna kill you with our pike beam. Your Zoltan shield is no match, and it was good that we killed them because they we got extra stuff from the other guys. Okay, uh, selling drone parts. Oh. You know what? I'm going to sell six of them. I'm going to sell six drone parts for some easy money. We're not using them right now. There's a chance we won't use them at all. And I don't want to go to this Nebula, so we're going to the pirate control sector. The Nebula is not quite as bad for this ship because he doesn't have a scanner anyway. But still. Uh, okay, three Nebula beacons will give us one extra jump. So we're definitely going to go to them, and I think we're going to start at them. I think we're going to hit these two, and then we're going to go down here. And we're not going to buy anything until we see if there's a store down there. Uh, intruders on board. Hey, this is what we've been waiting for. Okay, you stay in there. And actually, honestly, I should be standing on doors, and nobody should be uh, on shields. But I've almost got my 100% dodge. So it would be kind of dumb... For me to leave the cockpit. Okay, you were a little bit closer than I expected you to be, but what are you going to do? Going to heal these guys up. We're just going to jump to another nebula when they're ready here. I much prefer crew to drones, that's sure. Simply because they get experience. I mean, we got two kills experience for that that we wouldn't have gotten. 
Attempt to follow and help them. Sure. Oh, no. Okay. Charge Ion right at the shields, and it's going to stay there forever. Uh, they can't hurt us, so I think we are going to heavy laser their shields so they won't come back up. And then we're going to pike beam up like this. And you should be on shields for the chance of dodging. Uh, except they're offered no. <laughs> hey, you got some shield experience. <laughs> okay, scrap recovery arm. Nice. Okay, there's no store here, but I think we're gonna we're gonna buy a single power and we're gonna take it out of here and put it in here. I'm trying to use my scrap without spending too much of it, because if we come across a store that has a ton of cool stuff, I want to be able to buy it all. Okay. Really? Oh, I guess you have a teleporter. That's your that's your plan. Get her. That's your plan. Okay, Mr. Rockman. You came in alone, and you're going to die alone. Okay, we took that down. Let's go ahead and take out their teleporter just to be jerks. And then let's pike beam them. Med bay. Can we get through the oxygen room and the engines and the shields? Yes, we can. Which basically means they're dead. Very nice. You two need to go to the med bay. 34 scrap. That works for me. <coughs> Is there a store? No. So we're going to go up to this. And I did plan that correctly, yeah, because that's going to give us an extra jump. That's, that's a, an entire free jump. <laughs>